organizing this event for the Pakistan Flood Relief. And hopefully, uh, we're looking for a very good evening. And hopefully, we should have uh, some good fundraising here. I believe today's event is solely for the flood victims. There are 20 million of them. Um, and, you know, whatever we're doing in the UK is still not enough. But I see this great effort from, you know, in Reading, there's one in Leicester, there's one in Leeds. So it's an ongoing sort of, uh, you know, uh, events that are happening. And people are very passionate about it. Pakistani people in the UK are very passionate about helping uh, the, you know, their brothers and sisters back home. The whole thing about tonight's program is really, is to help the Pakistani community who three months on are still struggling. So what we're trying to do here tonight, bring the whole community together, and it is bringing all aspects of all different parts of our community together so that we can raise some money, food, clothes, seed, so they can start uh, plant, planting the food again and uh, help them to get back on their feet again. Because uh, uh, the enormity of the problem is so large that we have, it, it will have to help them continually. Even the government can't do it all by themselves. So there is a degree of onus on us to help, help uh, people who need it. It's gone off the media now and people think that it's all over but it's not really. It's a huge task and the, our aim was mainly to get everybody together and remind people back again that I ain't gone nowhere yet because it's just a beginning. So today um, we're expecting here about a good thousand people to turn out and we're hopefully trying to raise some good money for tonight. And our aim is to keep reminding people that you know this is how it's going to be for the future to come. We've got to carry on doing whatever we can. It's not like tsunami or it's not like the earthquake where you have sudden deaths and you have a lot of casualties. This has displaced people, 20 million people. Now what's going to happen is that the deaths are going to come and the sickness is going to come now after the event. And people's memories are such that people lose focus and you know, unless it's in the news all the time, people sort of tend to forget the severity of the damage and the severity of the, of the impact of this whole flood. So this is really important that these events keep on going, you know, city by city, region by region, so that people are aware that, look, you know, people back home, it's not okay. It's a long-term effort. Uh, you know, it's going to take two or three years to uh, rebuild them, rehouse them, rehabilitate them. It's really important for Pakistanis uh, to, you know, keep this momentum going. And this, these events help because they're in the news and they actually, you know, uh, make others realize that, look, people are working hard, but there's a, there is an issue back home.